The Earth's magnetic field is similar to that of a barb magnet tilted 11 degrees from the spin axis of the Earth. Just like so. The problem with the picture is that the Curie temperature of iron is about 770 degrees Celsius. The Earth's core is hotter than that and therefore not magnetic. So how did the Earth get its magnetic field? Magnetic fields surround electric currents. So we surmise the circulating electric currents in the Earth's molten metallic core are the origin of the magnetic field. A current loop gives a field similar to that of the Earth. The magnetic field magnitude measured at the surface of the Earth is about half a Gauss and dips toward the Earth in the northern hemisphere. The magnitude varies over the surface of the Earth in the range of 0.3 to 0.6 Gauss. The Earth's magnetic field is attributed to a, di to a dy dynamo effect of circulating electric current, but it is not constant in direction. Rock specimens of different age in some of the locations have different directions of permanent magnetization. Evidence of four 171 magnetic field reversals during the past 71 million years have been reported. Although the details of the dynamo effect are not known in detail, the rotation of the Earth plays in part in generating the currents that are presumed to be the source of magnetic field. Mariner 2 found that Venus does not have such a magnetic field, although its core iron content must be similar to that of the Earth. Venus's rotation period of 243 Earth days is just too slow to produce a dynamo effect. Interaction of the terrestrial magnetic field with particles from the solar wind sets up the conditions for the aurora phenomena near the poles. The thing that we call the Earth's magnetic north pole is actually the south pole of the magnet inside the Earth. So there's the south pole. When we have a magnet, the north part of the magnet point towards the south pole. So the magnetic north pole and the geographic north pole are different, and the geographic south pole and the magnetic south pole are different based on the tilt of the Earth and the rotation. The north pole of the compass needle and the magnetic north pole is attracted to the geographic it is attracted to the geographic north pole which is a magnetic south pole opposite magnetic poles attract so when, when you see the magnet the south pole and the north pole of the earth attract while the north pole is attracted to the south pole of the earth 